What is up, rockers? And welcome to the newest episode of Exclusives, where today um, we are going to be basically venturing to Canada. So this is me on my new camera, by the way, the HTC RE, um, and I'm going to be taking you on an adventure to Canada. We're going to be going to Montreal, we're going to be going to Quebec City, uh, then we're going to be coming back down uh, to Portland, uh, Maine, and then we're going to be stopping in Boston before we venture home. Um, this is going to be a pretty big trip. It's about about a week and a half, um, and so it's going to be a little longer than the last trip I took, which was only four days. But yeah, I'll be really fun. I am actually really excited to be using this camera. This thing just feels great using it. Um, it's really comfortable because it's going to be beautiful in Canada. It's cold always. <laughs> It's not actually cold always, but it's gonna be like 80. Well, uh, we're out here to switch drivers on the way and we've just run into what looks like it's gonna be an awesome rainstorm. Look at the clouds. It's just getting dark and everything. I just play love by ear and hope to get the picture. I'm shooting for her heart, got my finger on the trigger. She can be my broad and I can be her nigga, but... Looks like we may have stumbled upon a little festival, the Francofolies de Montreal, uh, over here. So we're gonna check it out. Looks like fun. Like it also comes with white rice. Here we go. That's, that's delicious. Every time I see a city during the day, I think it's absolutely beautiful, but my my opinion of that city completely reworks itself at night. I have to say, seeing Montreal at night is something else. It's quieter, there's not people honking and making lots of noise, the streets are actually quite calm for the most part. Hello Montreal! <laughs> uh, it's day two, uh, we just got up pretty not too long ago. We are ready to go though. Everything is everything's all packed up. I got my nice little side bag here by the way. But yeah, so we're headed out uh, for a nice day in Montreal. Uh, hopefully we find some cool stuff to do. And so right now we are on our way to the Basilic de Notre Dame de Montreal. Was to never cry, work till you're tired, got to provide. Always be the rock for my fam, protect them by all means and give We have found Chinatown. It's way down there, but it's there. Our relationship is suffering, trying to give you what I never had. You say I don't know how to love you, babe. Well, I say show me the way. So they actually have charging stations for electric cars. Uh, like sitting on the street. This is really cool. There's actually a Tesla right over here being charged. Which, first of all, beautiful Tesla, for sure. But it's just sitting here being charged. And I, I think that's so cool. Teach me how to love, how I can get my emotions involved. Teach me, show me how to love, show me the way to surrender my heart. Girl, I'm so lost. Teach me how to love, how I can get my emotions involved. So, this is the Notre Dame, uh, the Montreal. 
um, and it's absolutely beautiful. Just absolutely amazing. Um, just the amount of detail and the architectural construction is just amazing. Even the stained glass windows and the roof each of a different color, like it's so cool. Yeah, it's just this. <laughs> it's so great. I love this. I just checked out a beautiful little uh, French shop um, right near the uh, the Notre Dame. I found this really cool little knife. Apparently, it's actually made from buffalo bone. It's like a paper shop, so they have a lot of like very nice French products for like writing and, and things like that. It was really cool. So now I think we're headed to Old Montreal. Uh, we're gonna see what's over there. Show me how to love. Show me the way to surrender my heart. Girl, I'm so lost. Teach me how to love. It's funny how you travel hours away to try to get away from, you know, where you usually live and, you know, the, the stresses of everyday life. And then you find out that someone where you went has the exact same car as you do. Is... <laughs> I have no words. Teach me, please just show me. Yeah. I'm currently looking for somebody. Uh, we're having a little bit of difficulty with that because, of course, you know, finding a place to eat is apparently really difficult to do. Um, we're gonna try to find a place to eat, and then we're going to eat food for lunch. Yay! All right, so I've assembled my plate at the epic restaurant, and now I'm gonna eat it. Because it looks delicious. So, got a few extras of these Nutella filled donuts. These things are so good. Yes. Oh my goodness. Actually, it's a hurricane. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Only in Montreal. I <laughs> love that sound. So. Walking through old Montreal, transitioning into new. You can see the old buildings. Yeah, and then they, they got the new buildings all around it. It's awesome. It's so cool. Ooh, ooh, teach me how to love. I think we found the Olympic thing we've been looking for. So this is some sort of Olympic center. And then they've got this. That thing looks really cool. <laughs> so we're at a park and we're gonna climb up a, up a thing. Get to look out. It's gonna be an overlook of the city. It's gonna be literally. So that was the shortest hike ever, but uh, <laughs> I'll tell you, the view was absolutely worth it. Check this out. Solid five minute hike to a beautiful view. All right, so we just finished up a solid dinner at a little bar and grill. Um, definitely more bar than grill, I think. We had some poutine, um, and then we also tried the steamed ham sandwich. What was it, the steamed meat? Steamed meat sandwich? The smoked meat sandwich. Steamed yeah. meat, oh my god. I don't know. You, we had a, a, a smoked meat sandwich. We're just gonna walk around the city for a little bit. So I'm not sure if I said it already. But uh, <laughs> welcome to day three of vacation. Uh, we are still in Montreal. Um, I am still standing on the balcony that you've seen me on many times throughout this trip. And uh, I'm looking at another beautiful, beautiful morning. This morning I had this idea, I really wanted to uh, get up and just sit here and watch anime for a while because I think that'd be like beautiful. So I think tomorrow I'm going to sit out here for a little bit and uh, watch some, uh, some anime. we got to find a good anime, we'll probably start or I might just watch some more Kobayashi. But I think I'll probably come back out here tomorrow and uh, maybe finish that show if I get up early enough to see. Alright, so right now we're trying to find our way to uh, the little park. parking garage we just ended up in but it's so big it feels more like and it has like so many like sounds it kind of feels like we're in an industrial compound
behind us. It's awesome. They're doing some repairs, but it still looks pretty cool. Restaurant we came to. Okay. If you're in Montreal, definitely check if it out. If you're in Montreal, you should definitely check out Cantapia. I think that's how it's pronounced, but I'm really not sure. We're gonna get some pictures. I assume that you know, since you guys actually do my channel, you probably have seen the great job pooping meme. Um, and I have found it in real life, kind of. Uh, this is a group of men making a poop circle. Oh. Sorry, little side note. Beautiful. Um, so, we are currently walking through, I think, what is considered old Quebec City. Uh, and we finally made it to Quebec City. By the way, in fact, I don't think I can mention that. We're currently walking by the Quebec City Hall. Posting is the picture. I'm shooting for her heart. Got my finger on the trigger. She can be my broad, and I can be her nigga, but. here is fantastic it's like every other building you see is just absolutely beautiful uh, we're we'll currently walking back all these really cool uh, statues and stuff we're gonna check out the water park. Um, not really sure what's there oh we get this huge statue next to us here checked out a few other statues here and uh yeah we're gonna check out the waterfront real quick <laughs> Okay, so we found a place called Baguette and Chocolate. And I think we're gonna stop there because let's be honest, what don't we want? I don't even know what I'm saying right now, but we're going there because it looks amazing. We're about to get back to the car. We're gonna check into the hotel. So we're currently walking down what's basically like Main Street of Quebec City. 
Um, and there's so many restaurants and stuff here. It's actually kind of crazy. Everybody's eating outside. We've been just chilling. Uh, we were sitting in the in the hotel for a while. I was actually editing a video. But uh, now we're just walking down the street. Check this out. There's all these restaurants. The food is here. Uh, so we're going to be trying everything. But I will definitely show you uh, me eating the escargot because that's going to be quite interesting. Wait, do I eat all this with it too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, why is it worse for me to watch than them to eat it? Honestly, I really just tasted the cheese. The cheese yeah. kind of overpowered it. Yeah. Um, Are you just trying to say this so I don't eat it? No, honestly, I bit into it and it just tasted like cheese. So, we just got back to the hotel and you might be wondering why the lights are turned off. Well, we just looked out the window. <laughs> Alright, so I haven't actually shown you guys any of the time we spent just kind of hanging around the, uh, the hotel or anything, but now that we're in Quebec City, I was like, you know what, why not? I might as well show you. Um, so my sister's over there, chilling in bed, watching some TV and such, um, while I'm set up over here in a nice chair. Um, and I am doing some editing. Uh, this here is the, the Beach with My Friends vlog that went up on the exclusives part of the channel. It's gonna continue editing this video, and then we're probably gonna hit the sack for the night, um, because that's all I have energy to left to do. Um, so yeah, see you tomorrow, boys and girls, because I always say that. I gotta stop saying that. It's really bad. It's terrible. But, um, good night, everybody. If you guys enjoyed this video, then you should totally check out these two videos right here. They're similar, and I think you'll also enjoy them. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Train go boom. Train go boom. Train go boom. Train go boom.